about enjoy the day's events. We started off with an amazing scientific presentation by Dr. Praveen Vemula and ended up with another amazing presentation by Dr. Shodav Ghosh. So I guess uh, it is the way I would like to interpret the events, the day's events, is that great science underlies great technology. And we should, as individual students, researchers, even industry, we should aspire to translate ideas where the science is robust. Okay? Without robust science, we can keep on doing products which can be reverse engineered easily and be made products in a very short span of time, but may not stand the test of time. So I think that is one thing which at least one important lesson that I take away from these day's proceedings. So we had an amazing set of presenters from very diverse backgrounds with very different perspectives. And from the context of this debate of academia versus industry, I think there has to be a way of thinking around this publication versus product debate. So while discussing with uh, Professor Amitabha Bandhavadhyay, he mentioned that in IIT Kanpur, they have already put in place a process wherein someone who is exclusively focused on working on product development is going to be evaluated based on the TRL level of the technology that he or she has developed. I think that is something which is you know, it's very important for academic institutes so that instead of just being evaluated and rejected based on some publications, you can actually force yourself to work on something which you really care about as opposed to what the system cares about. From the industry perspective, there is hesitation, but I do think that there are already, you know, compared to 20 years back, if you see, in spite of the hesitation, there has been a lot of proactive engagement between industry and academia on multiple occasions. This has to increase, so instead of harping on what did not happen, what can be changed, we have to make best examples of what worked in many different scenarios. And startup is clearly one instance where I would say the startups would benefit by engaging with academia so that, that the success can happen in a relatively shorter time where the startup remains focused on their goal of turning around a product within a very shorter time while the academic partner can really <coughs> do the due diligence on the academic front in terms of data robustness. The last thing I was, you know, going to say that in IIT Kanpur, of course, this event really brought about or highlighted the challenges which we still face as of today, but which we must try put in an active effort in trying to circumvent the challenges. And Wadhwani Research Center, by organizing this event, has laid down the stone that instead of just again going back and having the same discussion with the same points after another year or so. By the next year, hopefully we have some success stories saying that, okay, as a consequence of this meeting, there were these, these finite instances where a collaboration did get started. I think, so instead of focusing, so instead of focusing purely on the negatives of what did not work, we should create positive examples of what worked and try to learn from them why they did work. So with that, I would like to you know, thank uh, once again the speakers, the panelists, and the moderators for this uh, you know, tremendous day of learning. I think for me, there were multiple instances where I really rethought as to what are some of the strategies that I need to change in the way that I function in my lab and how I need to engage partners outside. It was really motivating to see the role played by non-profit organizations and the, the impact that they can make given that they do not have the financial baggage to keep up but yet putting forward and taking forward ideas which really make a difference uh, so this event was sponsored once again abhijit had mentioned at the beginning so by mp bio high media the ioe cell of iit bombay and sam instruments who provided the refreshments so thanks to them that we had a well-organized you know, day. 
the audience was prolific. There were lots of good questions, lots of interactions, and in fact, we had to really keep our panel discussion. I mean, we have to say, okay, now we want to you know, stop our panel discussion. And in spite of the best efforts of Abhijit as moderator throughout of the day, still our, you know, we, maybe we could have done better on time, but nonetheless, bottom line, everyone is happy with the proceedings and the learnings and the interaction with each other. So we thank the VMCC staff and the guest house staff for making sure that our visitors actually have a comfortable time in the guest house. And our VMCC staff actually managed the daily logistics necessary for making this event a success. Of course, this event would not have happened without the participation of the volunteers who had, most of them who had assembled here the morning at eight o'clock and have been you know, constantly attending to various activities throughout the day, keeping making sure this has worked. In this context, I would specifically like to mention the, part, you know, the contribution made by Rutuja. She designed all the graphical content and the spaces, as well as Mahesh, who took care of the website stuff. Mahesh is our CSAT in bio department. Last but not the least, uh, the, work, the WRCB team, or CIC Professor Devjani Paul, she was played a very, she and our CEO Abdul played an active role in really thinking about how to make this event, what should be the theme of this event. So in this context, Abhijit had a, actually played a major role. In fact, most of the participants, the invited participants were known to him. So again, a big shout out to Abhijit. So it could actually connect uh, many of the really well-established people who perhaps would not have responded if I had sent out an email. <laughs> and of course, it goes without saying that our WRCB staff who actually shepherded this process of releasing the logistics since the time we conceived this event. So Devanshi, Sneha, Meera, Radha, they were absolutely important in this whole society. <laughs> Chandrakan, who is the office staff, who you know, made sure that we were well fed throughout our multiple meetings. Okay, so before I end, I would like to announce the poster awards. So the poster evaluation was done by three panels, and each panel was instructed to choose one candidate. So however, one particular panel found two candidates who were equally good. Hence, we have a total of four participants who are going to receive the poster awards. I'd like to call out your name. First is Komal Patel.
projects of collaboration. With that, I thank you. A special shout out to you know for Shamik as well because he did not miss it. And for Shamik, he did not turn around when he came. So you know throughout the planning section, you know their inputs were absolutely critical. And may I request all the volunteers to come here at least you know to have a final group photo. All the volunteers that you around, please come here. And the documents will be taken off here. Yes, we can call them. Aspeha is here. Aspeha, we are so the Rafa is not here. Call them. Please, all the volunteers, can you please come here? And I will also request all the speakers so that the volunteers can have a photo. You might be getting a bit tired, but. रिकॉर्ड बंद करो कराओ ना। रिस्ट्रिक्शन का चीज़। यार बोल दे। ऑडियंस लोगों यहाँ से ही ना। धीरज भाई जाओ ना थोड़ा
ಕೊಟ್ಟು